Hello, my name is Sinead. I am a Universal Healing Tao Qigong teacher and a doctor of Chinese medicine. I'm going to teach you a basic Qigong routine you can practice by yourself every day if you'd like. Start by stepping your feet apart a little wider than your hips and sway your body weight right and left. Start to float your arms like seaweed in the ocean and make your spine into a piece of seaweed also and root your feet into the ground almost like they're buried in warm sand. Start to stretch your arms inside this water and move your spine like seaweed. Relax your jaw, relax the back of your neck, relax your hips, and dig your toes into the sand. Good, loosening up the spine even more now. Crane neck with your feet wide, stick your chin out, and exhale as you dive your body down. You can hold onto your thighs. Inhale as you roll up, Exhale as you roll down. So from the side it looks like this. Press through your heels, squeeze your glutes. Then exhale, stretch your spine out very long. Feel each vertebrae rolling up. Big exhale, dive back down. Move your head and your neck. Five, four, big deep breaths. When we open the spine, we hope open energy flow all over the body. Last one. And roll up. Good, now we'll open the hips. Take your hands to your waist. Bend your knees a little bit. Sink down like you just landed on the ground. Push your hips forward to the side, to the back, and the other side. Breathe in as you go forward. Out as you go back. You can gaze down or close your eyes once you have the movement. And take deep breaths all the way down into your belly, hips, low back. And try to feel the front oh, sides and back of your hips. This is really good for if you've been sitting all day or you're about to sit all day. And feel the gentle weight shift between your feet and the ground. Switch directions. Exhaling half the circle, inhaling half the circle. And if you have any tension or tightness or pain in your hips, you can imagine a warm sun shining down on your hips, your back, your waist. Relaxing your hip muscles melting away the tension. Almost like you're drilling your legs down into the ground, becoming more present, taking the pressure off of your back. Good, and come up to the center. Now just for a moment, push your hips forward with your knees slightly bent. Have your hands for support to protect your back. And you can sway your hips a little bit side to side. Stretch out and open the psoas muscle. We really strain this muscle by sitting too much. So it attaches at your lower vertebrae and wraps around the front of your inner thigh and your pelvis. So loosen it up, sway, keep the knees bent. Keep pressing down with your hands, lifting your chest. <sighs> this one feels really good. 
Good, come up, bend your knees again, and then just hang over your legs, shake your head. Knees stay bent, you can sway your torso side to side a little bit. Wanna open up the energy flow to the lower back where the kidneys live. Kidneys are the root of life in Chinese medicine and Qigong. They're the body's filter. So sway the body from right to left side. Feel the weight of the upper body and the legs helping to stretch open the waist and the back. Good, pause in the center and just take three deep breaths into the belly. Exhale, squeeze the belly to the spine. Feel the head get heavier. Inhale. Exhale, squeeze. One more. Squeeze and lift pelvic floor. Slowly roll up to stand. Good, just run your fingers through your hair. Wake up your senses, your brain. Clear your mind, front to back. Use your fingernails. Good. Now we'll do the shoulders. Inhale, roll up. Exhale, back and down. Sink into the knees. You can take a big sigh. Dropping any unconscious tension in the neck and shoulders. Drop it down to the ground. Let your feet sink into that warm sand. When we open the joints, we open energy flow to the whole body. You can move your elbows and your wrists as well. Sighing. Three. Two. And relax the shoulders down. Spinal cord breathing, another spine opener. Inhale, nice big step, elbows arch, back arch. So you wanna stick out your tail, but pull your chin in so the back of the neck gets long. This is the inhale position. Exhale, step the feet together, round the back, point the elbows towards the belly. Inhale to arch, squeeze your shoulder blades. Exhale, round, contract your belly, open your back. Inhale, arch. Imagine a golden light filling your bones, your spine, your brain. Exhale. Imagine a gray smoke leaving your body. Any tension, any pain. Inhale, arch. Breathe in gold. See it fill your bones, bone marrow. Exhale, gray. Sick, stale energy. Let's do three more. Inhale. See and feel the lights. Exhale. Two. Let go to the earth. One. Hold here. Sky breathing. So open your chest to the sky. Open your palms, open your forehead, and breathe in the golden sun. Let it fill your brain, your senses, your palms, your heart, your throat, thymus gland. Let it pour and drip down through all your organs, bones, glands. Opening the chest, squeezing the back for three. Two. And relax. Good. Now we'll start our Qigong form called moving Qi between heaven and earth. Heaven and earth are metaphors in Qigong for 
earth is the dense, the solid, that which supports our physical body. Heaven is expansion, ideas, uh, the, the inspiration of the stars like our destiny. And so we're inspired by the heavens. We want to expand our mind. We want to do things with our life. And we're nourished by and supported by the earth, our food, water, clothing, etc. So to move chi between these two, we find a balance between the manifest reality that we're experiencing and our ambitions. So we always want to achieve our dreams in life. And Qigong is a very special way of aligning your physical body and your mental body with your destiny. Feel your feet on the ground. Step one, knees stay slightly bent. They could be as wide as or wider than your hips. Make sure your toes point forward instead of out. Drop your tailbone, let it be heavy. You can do a little bit more pelvic rocking. Maybe imagine you have a big tail behind you. Drag it across the floor, across that warm sand, bottom of the ocean. Good, and then let it just hang down between your legs, heavy on the ground. Then find the top of your head, you can tap there. Feel the top of the head is open to receive starlight, sunlight, moonlight from the sky. And use your imagination, be like a little kid. So just imagine, you can close your eyes for a moment, that your feet are heavy in the sand, your head is reaching all the way up into the stars, the galaxies, and the spine descends from the neck down through the organs, pelvis, down through the legs into the ground forming a connection between the ground and the sky. Long neck, soft face, and just start to soften all your joints. We warmed up the joints a bit in order to soften and open the energy flow. Let your weight sink into your feet, into the earth. And let your spine, your neck, your skull float up towards the sky. Moving chi between heaven and earth. It's an inhale to bend your knees and lift your arms, soft hands, just to the level of your shoulders. Exhale, straighten and press down. Inhale to bend, sink your tail into the ground, sink your heels. Exhale, grow taller, palms, feet face the earth. Inhale. Exhale. Pause for a moment. Feel a connection between your hands and the ground. Spiral your hands, soft fingers, soft elbows, soft shoulders. And imagine you could become sensitive to an energy coming off of the earth, like a field you can feel. Everything has a field. Spiral the other way. You can close your eyes if it helps you. And really feel the field of the earth. It's not a metaphor, it's a real sensation. And then pump your hands up and down like you're bouncing two chi balls between your hands and the earth. Feel something pushing back at you. Feel it pushing back from your legs as well. And feel that force push up through your whole body like a trampoline inside the earth. Anti-gravity. Imagine anti-gravity for a moment as you Exaggerate the movement, lifting and dropping your hands, your hips, your head, your tail. <sighs> Over exaggerate, really feel a bounciness like you're on a moon bounce. <laughs> Good, relax, float back inside water, seaweed arms, seaweed spine. 
Heavy feet, warm sand. Long tail. And come back to the form. We'll do six more. When you practice on your own, you can do nine rounds. I just wanted to give you an idea of the anti-gravity sensation. The earth projects a force up into your body and you can also sink down into the earth. At the same time, imagine growing closer to and further away from the sky with your upper body. So we're receiving energy from many places. That's what Qigong teaches you to do. You receive energy from the earth in a very literal way by eating and so forth, but also from just opening up and receiving the force that's pushing back against you. We receive energy from the sky literally in the form of light. Light is a form of energy. And then we receive a, a awareness of space. So much of our mental and physical suffering comes from not feeling spacious. So when we practice Qigong, especially when we practice in a beautiful place in nature, we can regain and reconnect to the spaciousness that's all around and within our own mind. So get ready, find your stance, feet heavy on the ground, knees bent, feet point straight forward. Relax your shoulders, maybe squeeze them, inhale, exhale, drop. Do it again. And let's begin. Soft hands, hands connected to the earth, hands connected to your own heart. Inhale. Sink into the ground, exhale. Inhale. Let the earth come up under your hands into your feet, legs, spine. Exhale, sink down into it. Keep going. Relax every joint, your ankles, your knees, your hips, your shoulders. your elbows, your wrists, all 10 fingers and all the little joints inside. Relax the back of your neck and your jaw. Relaxing each vertebrae, letting the disc space grow, decompress. Let's do just one more. Imagine you're floating. And then rest in a wuji stance. Weight slightly on your heels. Space underneath your armpits as if you have floaties on. Relax your fingers, lengthen your neck, tongue on the roof of your mouth, close your eyes. Open the soles of your feet. Imagine breathing through the soles of your feet. Open the crown of your head. Imagine breathing through the very top of your head, through your skull, down into your brain, down into your spine. Find your center. Channeling energy between the ground and the sky. Between the form and the formless. Relax, closing movement. Three times, inhale, arms reach up into the sky. Imagine grabbing a white light or the light of your guiding star. Face the palms toward the top of the head, make a ha sound. 
and bring this light as you exhale across and inside every cell of your body from head to toe, out through the feet, clearing any remaining tension, negativity, stress. Inhale. Guide the light down as you exhale. One more. Releasing negativity into the ground, grounding wire. Sweep your arms across the front of your body, in front of your forehead, connecting to your center of wisdom, intelligence. Guide the hands slowly down from the mid eyebrow to the center of the chest. Center of love, compassion. Guide the hands down and the energy down to below your navel. Center of physical vitality and the seat of your awareness. Close your eyes and focus on the space below your navel, soft hands, soft belly, soft knees. Place one hand over the other, over your navel or under your navel and step your feet together. Feel the warmth of your hands and take a deep breath into your hands. Exhale, sigh. <sighs> Do it again. <sighs> Good, like you just ate a nice, big, delicious meal. Rub your belly. And we say this is a way to digest the energy that you took in from your environment, from your concentration. Go the other way. Feel your warm hands spiraling around your navel. Collect your hands at your lower abdomen one more time and feel a smiling sun in your lower belly. And feel that smiling sun spread through your pelvis, your legs, into your feet, the ground up through your organs, chest, throat, face. Let the smile come to your face and let it radiate out from every cell of your body. Cultivating vitality and sharing it with the world. Bring your arms up, big inhale. And drop and sigh. <laughs> One more time. Yawn and drop. <laughs> this is the end of practice. So again, my name is Sinead. Thank you for joining me. Subscribe for more free Qigong and yoga. Um, soon I will be doing more Qigong videos on a regular basis and planning to do some lives. So if you want to learn more Qigong, if you found this helpful, please share with your friends. And if you have any questions, you can contact me here or through my website, innerbodydata.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for practicing with me. And I'll see you next time.